Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back explorers. My name's Jack. You join me here after many, many, many requests. I know I didn't do the live stream. It was too late for me. I apologize. I live in England. It is what it is. I'm filming this just after the Bears have lost. Which sucks. So hopefully Larson can pull it out the bag for me and get a win. I know not every fan of nascar likes the shorter tracks because it's hard to pass there's no real skill i've heard it's once you're in front you've just got to make sure you have the aggression to stay in front stuff like that so i'm excited to see i'll be honest at this point i feel like i'm a curse on larson because ever since i've been a fan of him <sighs> he's not been doing very well has he now so Larson, Elliot, Byron, Bowman, any one of the Hendrix team, please, please do well this evening. But Larson, I'm counting on you, my friend. If you're new around here and you like what you see, please leave a like, a comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It lets YouTube know I'm doing something you enjoy. And if you're old around here, welcome back, explorers. <sighs> we are so close to the end of the season. I'm excited, you're excited. The child out there crying is excited. <laughs> I won't keep you here too long. Let's get into it. <sighs> As the saying goes, it's Bristol, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's Bristol, go. baby. Here we go. Replay. Alex Bowman continues his amazing race. One of 500. Here we go. Stoic in the face of criticism. And the Hendrick man leads this race early. Oh, we got Bowman out in front in the 48, I think. Up is the 48. And tucks back in behind Oh, here we go. We got Bowman, Bowman Truex, Truex Larson, Bell, and Byron. Oh, no. We got Bowman and Larson up front. There we go, boys. I am a little bit emotionally charged right now because the Bears have just lost to the Colts. So please let me get someone have a win. A yellow already? Hunt and Emacek. Oh. Looks like he's having some issue with that rear tire. Right rear is giving him some issues. In trouble off of two, and then ultimately whatever happened to the car. Seems like he just had a blowout, spun out, contact. hit the wall. Pretty significant contact too. Mm, not much. There, it looks like all the tires are still inflated. I was trying to see if that right rear might have gone. Down I'm guessing, yeah, maybe the right, right rear hit the. Yeah, it must have what clipped the there? wall. A little contact. A little clip on the wall, Hard blown the tire out, maybe. Oh man, he's still chasing. Got a bit. Is he, Jeff? Yeah, they, they a cool DNS. In. I think he got really high in one and two and got up against the wall and and you know maybe cut a tire, maybe damaged the right rear tow link, something. We're getting ready for the restart. Lights the are restart. Up on the pace car. Ten of one twenty-five stage down. one. Back down onto the apron. Let's get this thing going again after an early. We've caution. got. By John Hunter, oh. Who's that? Who's? Oh, oh good jump from Bowman. Bowman, Larson. Truex, and Larson having a little bit of a battle Larson between Larson and Truex. Byron and Bell, your top five. Bowman, Truex, Larson, Byron, and Bell. Hosevar, well done, man. He done so good last weekend. In the Spire Motorsports Chevy, unreal. Qualified on the front row at Darlington, and here he is running at the front of the field, Jeff and Bristol. Here we go again. But Larson is only 26 above coming into this race. He has not had the smoothest playoffs as well. Larson has not had a smooth playoff, playoff so he points. really does need to get some points here. A little bit of insurance, no guarantees, but a little pressure off Cliff Daniels, Kyle Larson, and the five team. Half a mile to go, less than that. Fingers crossed he can get some. Stage one. If you are new around here, sorry to pause it there, please, if you are new around here, let me know who your favourite driver is. It's a custom round here, you've got to tell me who your favourite driver is, and also tell me a driver you cannot stand. Could be for any reason, but someone that when you see them, even, even when you see them, you, you just want to change the channel. So if they win, it boils your piss. Let me know down in the comments. I am warm from the Bears game. The 11th stage win this year for the five of Kyle Larson. That was convincing. 
Larson's out in front. Oh, Larson's out in front. Followed by Bowman, Bell and Truex. And then Byron. I'm not getting excited because Larson, whenever he seems to take the lead and I get up excited, especially when we watch live, it all goes wrong. While we're away, got the news from race control. There's been a penalty. Another penalty. To Joe Gibbs racing. To Joe Ty Gibbs. Ty Gibbs. He had a really solid opening stage, but this is going to hurt the playoff driver. Let's go. Stage two. Here we go again. Stage two. On the, inside, On the restart. Christopher Bell, Christopher Christopher Bell, Bell taking it to Larson. Larson. Larson gets out in front, followed by Truex and Bowman. Martin, Bowman Jr. right up that the arse of Bell. White car. We haven't spoken much about William Byron. He's going, he's going. It's a source of frustration for Byron that he's never led laps here. Never had a pole, never won. He said, <laughs> I'm one of those dominant cars, Jeff, at Bristol, where I could be the guy up the front. Byron's so never got the there. Front rather than being in this mess. Little contact. Oh, a little bit of contact oh, there. Wallace. Wallace getting a bit shifty with Byron. Never really spoken a lot about a little bit of contact. He too was in the top ten. Pretty much all of I know a lot of you guys are not a fan of Wallace. Back, something that just transpired. Watch that black car high up. Black car high Hedden up, 54. Right oh. Little the bit of shot out there. Was tail end of the field. He had to line up behind the lap. Oh, well. And this is what happens. I mean, look at the craziness, beating and banging. And it's a very and tight track. Larson is coming. Oi, it's a very tight track. <laughs> There's a caution out. Larson oh, sit out front, out. and it seems like. And the man who locked himself in at Atlanta Motor Speedway, Joey Logano. Mr. Boo Logano himself. Got a flat. Well, actually, yay, Logano's got a flat. <laughs> what caused this? Honestly, I hear he's a wonderful person, if you're new around here, but the joke is we always boo Logano. It's just a running joke. Started 22nd. Up to 12th. I'm not going to lie though. Contact there. Seems to be a lot of cautions and not much. There's contact from behind, or I still can't really tell. Contending race. Kind of no contending racing going on. No contentious. Like, it's just a bit. It's just a bit circular, if that makes sense. Oh, right, we all know what he just screamed. So, so how how bad is this race car, Steve? It's really hard to tell. Obviously. And you know what? I know not much must have happened because of how slow the replays are when they show them. Okay, the jump again. Reddick gets out in front of Larson, but Larson's got his foot on the floor on the inside. Larson takes off. There we go. I thought it would fire off quicker than that, but easily the 19 goes by. Now the 45 up the hill. Oh my, Larson has taken off. Truex right behind him, Reddick, Hamlin, and Big Bell, your top five. A half a lap now to just kind of almost stay side by side with the 11, Jeff, is the goal. Not allow a third lane for Christopher Bell. Out oh, Larson okay, there we go. Larson is going to win the stage. Get those points. That, that was only stage one. Okay, maybe some maybe some crazy shit did happen. It just all seemed a bit slow, if that, if that makes sense. Maybe I've been spoiled this season with the races I've been watching. Who knows? Martin Truex <laughs> and Denny Hamlin. That's got the in Ryan Truex, Martin Truex. There you go, Lee. Eyes wide open of the crew chief of the 19. Well, look at the points. Look what happens. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Last is still out in front by three seconds, three and a half seconds. That's, that's about a millennium in racing terms. I like the top line. I think it has the momentum. You have the least amount of risk. Chase as long as he stays out in front and doesn't let no one get near him, Larson's going to win. Oh my god, is Larson going to win? Is Larson going to win? <laughs> oh, if it does, boys, the rip will be gigantic that gets taken after this. Please, please let me see Larson win a race this season. Please. Wait, I've seen, I've seen two already. What am I on about? It's been a while, though. I feel like I've cursed him, so I just want him to win so bad. And more than three seconds out in the lead. Second, third, fourth, and fifth are all together. There we go. Larson's out by about four days in front. Another cool shot. Of Corey LaJoy. Corey LaJoy. Having such a good night. How dare you? Running in 11th. Qualified in the top 10. Can we be right front throw link? This is his final drive. Unlucky, though. Motorsports before. 
transitioning to Rick Ware Racing for next week's race in Kansas. Let's show you how it went down for LaJoy. Let's see what happened to LaJoy. The it must have been a slow night if we're on lap 320. Oi! Josh Berry. Contact with Josh Berry from that angle, and it's hard to tell. This is I why mean, we like contact. the safety really bungs, tell. the crash bungs on it's the wall. The corner to but know they who's just, climbing, who's going. The, the lives they've I'm saved sure are incredible. Because there's a fair, there's a, listen, it ain't crazy forces, but it's still enough to give you some real damage if that was just a solid concrete wall. Good reflectors there. Sorry guys. As we welcome you back to Bristol. Comes over the radio. Junior fan. And this Bass Pro Shops. What's happened? We don't have good news for you. He just apologized to his team on the radio. He got caught. Ah, he was too fast road. into pit road. Hold was on. Wasn't this the Bass Pro Shops sponsored event as well? Wasn't that this evening? <laughs> going so well ah so you dick oh it is it is the best pro shops that race you dick <laughs> come on larson elliot is hauling elliot has been spectacular go on chase and just sneaking his way forward through the top 10 there goes bubba wallace right wallace is coming around oh he could get dangerous wallace might get dirty if he Feels like he ain't gonna win. Whoa. Oh, lots of connections here. Lots of rubbing. The 99 and a 4 3. Suarez and Eric Suarez Jones going at it. What was all that? So he came over. Whoa! Comes across the I don't nose. think Jones knew he was there. Suarez is bad. He, was, he had his vision on the car in front, kind of thing. Not, really not sure what you should have been doing, there. but he was trying pretty hard. Daniel's trying. Last is out in front by two point three seconds and ahead of teammate Elliot. Walking a really delicate line right now. There's some big numbers being racked up here tonight under the lights of Carl Larson out Ten in the. Oh my the God! Ten Come on, Larson! Five seconds ahead. Test, Forty-one minutes. He's eight months three. ahead of everyone. Of 16 second laps, basically four seconds on the straightaway. But that makes me feel like he's got a pit. If anyone crashes out, sorry, I'm shouting because it's getting louder in my headphones. If anyone crashes out with three laps to go, I'm going to throw my shoe at them. It wasn't a great Watkins Glen. Oh, where is, where is Blaney in that lovely highlighter car? Come on, Larson. Six seconds ahead. Final lap. Let's go. Here we go. Yeah. business. <sighs> And we give you the updated playoff standings. Yeah, Here are the updated playoff standings. Kyle Larson out in number one now. There we go. That's what we need. Kyle, well done, lad. You had me panic in the last couple of weeks. I'm not going to lie. Now there are 12. 16 and Woo! 12 survive. Austin Cindric, a great first round. He's going to need a He's out in the front by 15 like points. Alex Listen, that could be swallowed up. Well so don't David get comfortable, Kyle. Oh, and that's where it ended that quickly. Right, on to next week. <sighs> Larson wins. Let me know down in the comments. I'm sure the loyal ones of you will. Please let me know down in the comments. The UK time of the upcoming week's race, AKA the race after Bristol 2024, in case you're watching this later, later down in the line. Let me know. If we can, we'll live stream it as usual. I'm excited. Oh, is it Talladega? It's Talladega, isn't it? I think we might have to do Talladega, right? <laughs> oh, now I'm really excited. Oh, have yourselves a great day. Be well and bye-bye.